Hey everyone. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. It's my birthday. What? And I'm in the kitchen. I got friends here. Merry and I've got some wine. And I also have a lot of really good tips for you guys. I've got a lot of things I've been thinking about. I know it's been a minute since I've done a video. Um, and I'll be able to share with you in detail what I've been doing behind the scenes, but it's all around self-development. It's all about the glow up. Mm -hmm. um, we're actually about to turn this corner into a new decade. So I was talking to some friends of mine and, and one of my girlfriends, um, Taisha Essie, we were thinking about just those things that we pulled out of this year. Some things about leveling up, some things that helped me level up along the way. Because I hear about the term to glow up, but now I really want to go over a few things that I know really helped me um, from health to wealth and to relationships and self-development. So I do have some friends here today. I have one friend that dropped off a very good gift. And this is probably the best birthday gift to give somebody. This is a gift of health. And if you look closely, some of you probably know what that is or not. But this is Irish Sea Moss. The great Irish sea moss and you see the key lime. So everybody in the wound school, everybody following this page, you're supposed to already know what key lime is for. So it's about that alkaline life. Okay, this is that Dr. Savy life. So I'm going to bring on someone that you probably have seen. You know, he's a friend of mine I met through Facebook. And we share um, the same passion for health. And I'm going to show you this too. This is the Irish sea moss gel. It's very big. It's a reason why we're all waking up if you can tell like a lot of black people are waking up we become more conscious about how we can have the best health how we can really start leveling up in our life we talk about it but we don't know how to do it a lot of times so i'm going to bring on without further ado one of my homies one of my friends and the reason i need to take a second to apologize to all taurus men because y'all really not that bad after all Plant-based Jeff, come on in here, Jeff. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up people? What's up? What's yes. up? Yes. So Jeff, right. you know this guy. I did say I have to apologize to Taurus's because right. I had this thing going on about Taurus's forever. You know, I was like, they're not. I hate them. They're lame. But here's the thing: Taurus is a hold your ass down. That Earth energy. It's about what's factual. Right? If it right. don't make dollars, it don't make sense. Logical. Very logical, practical people, and. They're about nature, the earth, and health, too. Right, right. Food. Right. Oh, my God. Food is big for Tauruses. Yeah. So, I want to give you an opportunity to tell people, what the hell is this stuff that look like potpourri? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So, what this is, we have here is Jamaican, Jamaican wild-crafted purple sea moss. This comes from the sea. It's, it's wild-crafted. So, you got two different kinds. You have wild-crafted and you got some that are that they grow in pools. Mm -hmm. So that's organic. You don't really want that. That's the stuff that you see in the flea market. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So the real, it got a lot of salt on it and mm -hmm. whatnot. But this is straight from the Jamaican Sea. I got video. I got documentation. But yeah. this has 92 How does minerals. It, smell? it smells it smell like, like the sea. It smells like the sea. So that's why when I made yours, I just made a fresh it smells batch. Like the sea. Yeah, I made you a fresh batch. But what I did was I squeezed some key limes in it to kind of mm -hmm. take off the taste a little bit. Because some people are kind of thrown off yeah. by that, the sea taste. But once you, you know, kind of reprogram your mind and know, mm -hmm. like, hey, this is a benefit to me. Yeah. You know, it has 92 minerals in it. Yes. The body is made up of 102 minerals. Mm. You get 92 just from this right here. So I can see and why it's, it's good so popular. For a lot of stuff for women. If you have thyroid issues. Yes. If you have yeah. trouble losing weight, if yeah. you don't know it's the thyroid. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it ties into all of that. Because for women, a lot of women don't know is thyroid issues are tied to iodine deficiencies. Correct. Mm -hmm. Correct. So you would see like, this is good because this is high in iodine. That's right. It's high in magnesium, mm -hmm. calcium for your bones, yeah. iron. I mean, instead of doing like a multivitamin, that's you what need, I was just this thinking. This is a multi mineral. It'll take care of everything. Everything. For that. Yeah. Now tell everybody, because Jeff, I mean, he looks good, but Jeff didn't always look good oh, yeah. like it this. Was a, it was a transition. You have a journey, yeah. okay? Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about your journey and what you did to, to get to this level to be so knowledgeable about all of these herbs and minerals. Okay, so about three years ago, I was about 75 pounds heavier. Mm -hmm. Toxic mindset. Had all kind of health issues pre-diabetic, high cholesterol, 
uh, erectile dysfunction. Mm-hmm. I'll put that out. Tell the truth of shame. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Had a lot of stuff. Sleep apnea. Okay. Uh, restless leg syndrome. I heard of that. Acid reflux. Mm-hmm. I had it all. Yeah. If, if, if it was something, I had it. Mm-hmm. I was on eight different medications for anxiety, depression, yeah. everything. So I just decided one day, I was like, enough is enough. Because that's the only time black men make a change. Yeah. You know, you got to damn near put us in the grave. I know. You know, if we Why got one. Why would it take all that for us to just turn things around? But I think that's how a lot of people are wired. It's mindset. It's yeah, our mentality. It's what we grew up on. Yeah. You know, because black men, we don't like to go to the doctors. Right. You right. know, when it's time for prostate, because my dad, he even told me, he was like, hey, man, I ain't even trying to, but he was like, man. Yeah. The doctor got to go do his thing. Yeah. But, you know, my dad would get tested and stuff, but he was kind of tell, telling me to prepare. But most black men, we don't like to go to the no. doctors. We don't take no. care of our health. Yeah. And that's why you got grandmama around, big mama around to 105. Yes. And big daddy yeah. checked out at 70. That's true. Mm. And we need to you be know? way more proactive about that. Right, right. Like, wow. We don't need to wait until something's wrong. Right. You know, so for me, I like making <clears throat> things very easy for people. Like, that was a turning point for me mm-hmm. when I started checking the foods mm-hmm. that I ate, making right. sure detox you is very serious. Yeah. So, it's not just about losing weight. I tell people, you're going to lose weight. Okay? Um, and even when you go and trans- transition to plant-based or vegan, people aren't getting the right minerals and enough right. minerals. And even people that say, oh, I tried that before. Need this. You know? Oh, it didn't work. And people that right. gain weight when they become vegan because they're right. basically you know, starchitarian. Mm-hmm. You know? And so they're eating French more fries. starches, french fries. And some things are technically vegan. Right. But it's not plant based, and so it's a big right. difference. What can right. you say to right. speak right. to that? Because we yeah. call him plant based Jeff. Y'all go follow him on Instagram, plant based Jeff. Okay. Yeah. So, so what's the so, difference so, when you tell people about so plant based and vegan? Yeah, yeah. So vegan, so vegetarian, they just don't eat meat. Mm-hmm. They eat cheese and whatnot and everything else. Mm-hmm. Vegans, they don't eat dairy. They don't eat meat. Mm-hmm. However. They do eat a lot of artificial things like, right. you know, uh, the Beyond Burgers, the Insta- the Impossible Burgers, mm-hmm. uh, all of this right. substitute right. meat, right. you know, soy products, um, the ice cream, mm-hmm. you know, all of that type mm-hmm. of stuff. Now, my lifestyle is more just plant-based, yeah. whole food, real food. Mm-hmm. An avocado is an avocado. A yeah. tomato is a tomato. You know, squash is squash. Mm-hmm. You know, so when I say plant based, I mean whole food. Yeah. So yeah. I don't do a lot of stuff. I keep it on like an 80 20. I'm not perfect. That's what she you says. Know, too. You know, when I go to, you know, plant based pizzeria, yeah. hey, I'm going to get some Beyond Burger. Yeah, crumbs yeah, crumbles. You know? Yeah, because they yeah, have yeah. a good little sausage pizza or something. Right, 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 right. Burger, right. yeah. But it's all about balance. So Somebody asked people, about what's in that bag. This is the Irish Sea Moss. So yeah, this is purple premium wild crafted. Oh, it's uh, purple. Yeah, it's purple. It, it has dust on it because it's from the sea. And I sell it. I keep it. So if you need some, get in contact with, with, with Yeah, because we're pushing it. Yeah. Listen, so this, this can change video. everything for people. That's the thing. Like, something this simple, everything people are dealing with, even when it comes to cancer, like those real illnesses yeah. that people are, say are not reversible. All of and that. I think you and I were talking about the other day. I have some yeah. friends here behind the camera that you can't see. Right. But we were saying... Even the first rule of naturopathic health is everything is reversible. Yeah. If you know about Dr. Sabe, if you know about that school of thought, the master mm-hmm. teachers, the queen mother of fools even, yeah. or even Dr. Layla Africa, understanding right. that there were different nutritional needs um, for the African. Mm-hmm. So if you're, you're in that school of thought, we know. We can reverse this stuff, and we've been trained to think that we need thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars to do it. We're getting hysterectomies, the fibroids, when this stuff can be reversed with a heating pad, castor oil. Look at chapter five in my book. This is stuff that can be easy to reverse. Indigenous remedies that grandma damn knew about. Right. You know, so this right here, if somebody was dealing with diabetes, that. Yeah, yeah, everything. So everything. everything, If you having thyroid issues for women, Mm -hmm. inflammation in the body. That's a every, big one. Let's every, just stop right there. Talk yeah. about that for a second. So inflammation in the body. So the stuff that we're eating, the meat that we're mm-hmm. eating, the processed foods that we're eating, mm-hmm. the sugar that we're eating, is causing inflammation. Inflammation, yeah. It's causing excess mucus. Correct. And that's the number one. And we one know enemy. mucus that's it. is the mother of all disease. She said, can it be mixed into a smoothie? Good question. Yeah, yeah. You can mix this. You can take it directly. You can put it in a smoothie. Now, how does it taste? Because I want to do a taste test on live. I mean, it depends on you. It's, it's all about your mindset. Because when you know, 
Ooh, this is see, fuel, my thing about this is that. fuel for the body. That's my thing. See, people wow. be we worried about how it tastes. Right, right. right. I said, hell with it. it. You can have worse in your mouth, girl. Ah. Wow. So don't come to me you don't want to taste. Right, right. Well, and see, what we got to get to, what we got to get to is, what people don't know is, we got to create the environment for our bodies to heal. Like, we can reverse anything. That's it. Like, when people have cancer and, and you go and get chemo, it smells they're good. trying to, you know, they're trying to destroy that cancer That's with radiation. Mm -hmm. But really, what you all you have to do is transition to a plant-based lifestyle. Ooh, this is going to be so ratchet to have this in some wine. It's a food, ain't it? But I'm going to taste test it, though. Yeah. Oh, shit. So we got to create the environment <laughs> to heal. <laughs> Look, I know I'm as naturopathic you must say, but girl, I still, you know. Is it gel? Look, mm -hmm. look, that's how they be doing on YouTube. They it's got a show. Like, uh, yeah. Like, uh, hey, it seems like like I, I take a shot. Laughing at me. Yeah. Yeah. You take a shot. Yeah. I, do, I do it just like that. I put right. some. I take a shot. You know, y'all like don't judge because I mean this is gonna be hilarious, girl. But like I said, you can't worse than your You can put it. You can put it in your tea too. You do that. Key lime. <laughs> <laughs> Got you right. Woo! <laughs> oh. And it's good, for, it's good for men too. It's good for men too. Okay. Hold on, all right. So, what, what yeah. you got to say? <laughs> Girl! Everybody should have a taste a taste of that, seriously. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Daily multivitamin. Ooh, yeah. Daily multivitamin. You do that in the morning. We sell food. We sell Yeah, we sell food into taking vitamins mm -hmm. when right. the body needs minerals. Minerals. And that's what we miss. That's, mi that's mm -hmm. what we're missing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This all you need. This is from the earth. Mm -hmm. We didn't put How much is this, Jeff? Because we about to start pushing this. This the real OG per yeah, yeah. per per. You so know. right now I'm running a special now for half a pound, mm -hmm. thirty dollars. Half pound. Free free shipping. That's a steal. Because mm -hmm. I mean, shipping costs y'all. Yeah, I went by the mail off. I went by the post office today and sent off like 20 orders. Wow, and I started to add up. I'm like, damn, I'm just my first time. Somebody get over okay. and it ain't me, <laughs> right? You know what I'm saying? So, this is a gift that I'm running throughout, you know, from right. Cyber Monday like all the way to Friday. Right. So, you can get a pound of $50 support black owned businesses. Yeah. That's big right now. Yeah, if you like me, you know, I know we're going to the new year. I'm ready to get my body right. This is what you how need. You go, how, is that you need to start off with the minerals, yeah. the nutrients, the, the education, detox. and the need, detox. The detox. And everybody has that word, you know, floating around. But as I said, it's all about how you start. And these are just a few tips that changed the game for me. Like, there's no reason why I can't have the health I want. Like, I got my little outfit on. I feel so good. You better. You know what I'm saying? You better. You know, this is 38. You know, after having a baby. But this right. area right here is everything. That colon, that detox, keeping your body feeling a certain way. I go to Effect Fitness. I actually did a great workout before I came home to have my little birthday set and whatever. But I, those are things that I live by. Like, you have to do that. Detox, working out, water intake. So, that's from the health side of the game. Right. Those are some of the tips that I wanted to share. I'm on the wealth side of the game. We actually just talked about something about, you know, cross-pollination. Um, because as we said, it's about supporting us, building us up. And I love um, having this opportunity to share my platform and let you guys know. Because that's how we get together as a community. That's how right. we get more. Right. Um, so it's not just about us. When we go into 2020, we need to be thinking about building. So mm -hmm. I want you to tell everybody, like, what are some things that you have learned this year on business? Because I've been learning a lot. This is one of them. Right, right, your right. network is your net worth. Period. Right, right, right. Okay, because it's not just about you. Like that changed the game for me. Taiwan, knowing how to monetize the traffic. Like and, and Jeff and I, like having a mastermind group. What's one of the biggest things that you know on the wealth tip of the business game? That's a very good tip for any entrepreneur, anybody listening right now. Can you repeat that, please? I would say. Hi, What's up? Can you say hi to everybody on camera? Like my friends are here. <laughs> Behind this camera, it's a lot of my friends, so I want to just bring him. Oh, but just, I'm you sorry, say, just say hi real quick for everybody. What's up, family? How y'all doing? Yes. Right. Um, 
I can't. I just wanted to hear what you said. It sounded yeah. like it resonated with me. I was over here, but I know some resonated, so I had to come back. Yeah, you know, we like, almost have to. What like, was that? So what we were talking about is what's the tips that I came away with? Some of the biggest lessons that I learned this year. Yeah. And so we're like gonna talk business. about. We were talking about health earlier. Right. And so now we're talking about business. So right, right. This is one of the mastermind people that I met and a guy that I share my platform with, and we're gonna start yeah. with even more. I got a vegan right. cookbook coming out. He's got the um, vegan meal prep. Your webinar and class, right. and we're gonna be doing yeah, more yeah, things. My has the, That's what's up. The, the, uh, the, the meal prep. Yeah, yeah. practical <laughs> food. And I see they have the uh, meal prep. Mm -hmm. I have an I'm online them, transformation right. course that will help you go plant based, mm -hmm. and I also sell the sea moss as well. Okay. But, but you, you wanna, want me yeah, to? Yeah. What's some? Yeah, yeah. 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 What's some of the tips that you family? really came away with this year? Because for me, I do find the power in networking, cross pollination on social media. Right. That's been my bread and butter. It's taken right, me right. through. So what's something for you that's been a what game changer in business? This? I would say the number one thing for me, or one, one of the thing. top things, um, Stop going sense. in business trying to sell to your friends and family. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why. Like and stop getting mad when they don't so much. Mm -hmm. Like create something and understand like the people that buy my courses and my products have never met me. Mm -hmm. Your big, your biggest supporters won't be your blood. That's so real. And they won't be your best friend. That's so real. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I know. People that resonate with you. Yo, they buy your tribe. They write you. Yes, you right. right. So that was one of the things is like, you know, stop trying oh, to sell to your mama and, and daddy yeah. and, and all you're doing is showing stuff on Facebook. Oh, like, if you're in business, like in real business, yeah. you're going to have to run some paid advertisements. You're going to have to run some ads. You're going to have to get more eyeballs on your business mm -hmm. besides your homeboys, exactly. your homegirls, and your cousins. So you're saying basically broaden your spirit. You got business. to. And it's sure. a, it don't cost that much. Like I'm running ads right food. now. I'm paying like five, ten dollars. Look, you're supposed to my family still ain't bought my little twenty dollar little child. Yeah. And no shade to them, but what I will say, it blew my mind when I saw strangers support me. Yeah. And that's it was how it all us. Goes and I knew and I knew we did that. Yeah. But this was like 2016, 17. That's when it changed the game for me, the social media. Right. You know, and and being able to use that platform wisely and being right. able to monetize. Um, but again, for me, that is something that I feel like we need to be more open with sharing the game. Right. You know, because right. it's not that hard as we make it. And we yeah. have a lot of things that are holding us back too. Like you may have all the knowledge about doing something, but you right. may have some mental blocks. Yeah. Doing yeah. a video, that was a big block for me. Right. Like right. you have some insecurity, some things that's really holding you back. And unless you get past them, like those opportunities will still be there. And it's going to be haunting you year after year after year. A lot of you want to do videos right now. Tell me how it was for you starting off with videos. Because Jeff, honey, it was a time I knew him. He wasn't doing videos. Now you can't stop this man. Right, right, right. So, so like I said, I was like everybody else. I was a stroller. Like I was like, I'm just looking at everybody else. Mm -hmm. And I had a mindset shift because I joined the mastermind group. Tell everybody what, what that is. What is a mastermind? So group? a mastermind is basically a collective group of like-minded individuals. Like the group that I'm a part of is called Traffic, Sales, and Profit. Mm -hmm. And we, you know, we have a main group mm -hmm. that we have about 10,000 people. And then we have a mastermind group of about 94 businesses. Mm -hmm. Now, in that 94 group, you, you have to pay to be in. So it is an, an investment. Correct. And a lot of black people, we're not used to spending, you know, thousands of dollars right. for development but when i tell you the best investment is in yourself because yes, once you get your yes, mind yes. right talking yeah you know what i'm saying you could do yeah. anything like the stuff that i had like goals that i had set 10 years mm -hmm. out i'm doing them now because yeah. i'm watching millionaires black yes. millionaires right here in atlanta in Richmond, Ooh. Virginia, all over the place. Yeah. Like our mastermind is all over the mm -hmm. country. But a lot of people won't take it that far. Yeah. You won't even get active in a Facebook group. Right. Like like it's right. money right. everywhere. That's real. That's very like real. people saying it ain't no money out here. No, man, we are surrounded by money. We sure are. We we living What's in the abundance. I'm tagging you on. What's you the know? page? All right, Kathy. All right, Kathy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like the same. Yeah, so my Facebook. Yeah, so we live in yeah. yeah, so we live in an abundance, mm -hmm. you know. We so are. that was another takeaway is to you know, watch your circle. Watch who you yeah. surrounding yourself with. Because, you know, I mean, people can, your, your network is your network. Yes, it is. They can take you further and faster. Yeah. If you get with the right people. Yeah. Watch who you running with. Yes. Because who you running with will determine how fast you go. Because mm -hmm. you can be around some people just doing, you know, 
a, a cash out yeah. business right. selling just here in the West yeah. End right. when you can be in West Africa. Uh -oh. You can be on the West Come Coast. Come on now. You know, we got, we got, the, <laughs> internet. Like we got the internet, people. Mm -hmm. Do you know back in the day how much it was to spin up a website? $100,000. Oh, my God. Websites were so expensive. $100,000. Like, you had to have developers, engineers, right. everything. Now you can start a Shopify within 15 minutes. Correct. Straight up. Correct. Like what's your problem? Yes, you know, like like we yes. looking at hashtags, we looking at everything else. Being a consumer, when you need to be a controller and a mm. content creator, I love that. I love Straight that. Up. You know, because we got too many people strolling. You know, it, it's two people in the world. Yeah, you got, you got drifters and non-drifters. Mm. And drifters, they just blow any way the wind go. Yeah, Popeye mm. chicken, I'm that way. See? Jordans, I'm that way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Gossip, yeah. shade room, I'm that way. Mm -hmm. Non-drifters, we on a path. We intentional. That's we it. got goals, stuff set, and we got a plan. Because a lot of people got goals, but you don't got a plan. Right. That's the right. biggest thing I learned in business. Yes. Like, like, like it's cool to say, hey, I want to make a million dollars. How the hell you go get there? Mm -hmm. You trying to get from here to California, but you ain't got no plan on... Do I got to get gas? Do I need to stop to eat? Okay. You need to have a plan Let to know where you're going. about that plan because as I saw you, before you had your plant-based course, we were right. on the phone talking about it. Right, right, right. You yeah, know? yeah. And, and it I, was thank a you, I thank you. Now, Art yeah. was the reason that I got back to getting on camera wow. because when I saw her, and this is why I'm talking about your affiliation. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Watch you you running with. Yeah. Because you know what I'm saying? We mimic what we see. Mm -hmm. you know? You know what I'm saying? Because if I see somebody getting money, like I'm the type of person, you ain't got to hold my hand. Mm -hmm. If I see you do X, Y, and Z, I can do X, Y, and Z too. Right. And I saw her doing it and I said, you know what? Hell, I'm getting, I'm getting back on camera. Right. Because Art was on that every day. She's doing this. Hand clapping. Yeah. Like, cussing. Blah, 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 doing cussing. Thing. Just doing her, mm -hmm. being herself. Mm -hmm. And that's what it's all about. Yeah. I got a friend that he does a whole course around video confidence. Oh, I love like, that. Like, 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 yeah. shout, shout out to our money channel. Shout out yeah. to my money. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so he's worked with some heavy hitters. But I mean, you could just get out here watch. Like, like, stop being a watcher. Yeah. We creators. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah, creators. We got. Yeah, we got yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. People don't understand. We are creators. We, we manifest are. whatever that's we what think. That's what happened to me on social media. Like, it just blew my mind. I'm like, I can just get in front of this camera, do my thing, and the people that like me. And that's right. one thing. I saw, I was watching a lot of content creators in the past, too. Right. I had the baby, and I was depressed, but I would watch videos of these bloggers. And one in particular, shout out to Justin J. He's a Leo, and Leos are so truthful. And I watched how authentic he was. Right. And I noticed that when you're authentic, it moves people, it shifts people. Like right. that's what transforms. Right. You don't like even have to be perfect. <laughs> you, don't. you know? You know? And so he just showed up and we loved it. And I watched that for years. Right. You know, right. and I said, right. you know what? What I will do, because I learned, because I tried to come out before and I was very inauthentic. You know, I was hiding and stuff like that. But I said, mm -hmm. okay, when I come back, I want to be me. Mm -hmm. Like, because when you get into this game or you get into, you know, the industry of making videos and creating content or even building a business, if you're building a brand, one thing I definitely learned is to have an authentic or profitable brand. It needs to be authentic. It has to. You know, because it's not going to work for you. And people can feel it. They'll resonate with it. Because you're not trying to be something. And you attract your tribe, but you also attract the database. Right. Mm -hmm. That's going to be the people that buy from you. Right. You know what I mean? Right. And so by doing right. that, that's yeah. actually your database. So, okay. it's a lot. I want to bring on one person. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else you want to say? We got so Man, much so wisdom much. in this room right now. We got to share it. Somebody. Oh, yeah. we got to share this platform because I didn't learn so much. And I'm living in one of the principles that I learned, which is friendship. Mm -hmm. um, and the meeting of the minds and having people that will hold you accountable and having people that you transform with. Mm -hmm. um, my fitness journey, my health journey, I wasn't always this size. I went through a very, very heavy, dark, depressive state. Like, I came through that. Wow. And just like Monique said, hell, walking really saved me. It'll get you through. Like, sure fitness, mm -hmm. it right. will really get you back. And so the mind, the body, and the spirit... It's all I'll interconnected. It, it and so when you physically are feeling your body do things mentally, you start to achieve things you never thought you could achieve because right. the body's doing that. So it's a beautiful interconnectedness with it. And so um, another community that I found here was Effect Fitness and being able to 
work out around black people in a certain environment and having that energy and you find another like-minded people. So I, I found this one sister I'm going to bring on next. And instantly I knew her vibe was good. She has a similar haircut like mine. <laughs> and I was like, oh, hey, hair twin. Hey, hairstyle exactly. twin. Instantly. So come to find out she's one of my favorite Zodiac signs. Yes, that's the Gemini. And I was like, I'm not even surprised she's a Gemini. So I want to bring her on um, just to let you kind of get into her. Thank you so much, Thank Jeff. You. you guys go follow... Um, plant-based Jeff, yep. and oh, you got so cyber right. still going on yeah, right on, yeah. on the Irish Sea Moss, okay? Yeah, I'm gonna send you guys all this information. So up next we have a, a Katoya. Katoya. So you've been sitting here listening to us, and I want you to tell people She's on the health game, me. on um, the fitness game, mm -hmm. what you get out of Effect mm -hmm. Fitness, how long you've been going there, because that wow. is my shit. I fucks with Effect Fitness. Don't give me no Planet Fitness. Was it I choose Effect. Right. Now it's so good. Right. All right. This was. Y'all was coming to celebrate her birthday. And I did not know. Yeah, no, she didn't know she was going to get It was just going to be so like good. <laughs> this was good. Yeah. Um, again, I'm Katoya. I go to Effect and I started going. I teach at Vibra at Grant Park and I teach a weighted drumstick class called Pound. And all the instructors were going to this place. You favorite Fantasia girl. Oh, I've heard it before. It's like from a uh, nose up. It's <laughs> the same family reunion. But when you go mouth down, it's different. So mm -hmm. it's true. Yeah. She pretty. That's oh, so funny. So um, I was like, where is this place that all the instructors are going? Because mm -hmm. that's where I want to go. Yeah. And so I finally went at the beginning of January. Mm -hmm. This year. This year. That's it. Wow. And I went and my mind, okay. First of all, I made the mistake of going at 8 o'clock okay. and getting there at 7.55. Uh-huh. And then I was immediately turned away. Yeah. And I was like, no worries. Wow. I'm coming back to 10. Because this amount of melanin in one place for health and Can fitness. Can we just talk about that? This amount of black people of all shapes, sizes, That's what I said. fitness yep. levels. Yep. Oh, gosh. I was like... I was just like in fitness heaven mm -hmm. when I walked. Oh, and then the music, right? So, oh, yeah, just tell me about the music. Effectiveness, duly, all the trainings. I walked in and immediately it was like Atlanta. Mm -hmm. and right? Like, it was so like, good. this is why I like Atlanta. It's so oh true. God. And so that's what happened. And so then I met this beautiful spirit. Listen. Hey, yes, we in. Right. Hey. Hey. You know, I don't need no strength. I was immediately like, I love her so much. And every time and I, she be getting it too. I'm just she out goes trying. extra hard. I just try to be a good student. Like if they say do like this or whatever, she's like mm. they say go down and I'm gonna go down. She's I'm going just keep down trying. to I'm the carpet. Just, I got goals. Okay. Not a squat. You going down for the carpet? Stop it. That's what you do. I'm just trying. I'm just trying to so make sure. So what are your fitness goals and Ooh, what type of journey have you been on? So I am a mother as well, and I have mm -hmm. three children. Wow. And my body is going through lots of transition and all of those. And it started when I started doing group fitness teaching Pound. And I love Pound. And then Pound, what is that? Pound is a weighted drumstick okay. class. And you, you use, it's a full body cardio workout. And you do it to music. But you get to use these drumsticks. I mean, you do about... You know, three to five hundred squats in the class because you're just moving. I mean, we probably do the same thing in effect too. Oh my god! But you, it's fun, and I yeah. enjoyed it. I've always wanted to do drumming, and I love music, so it called me. But before then, I always stayed active and stuff. Mm -hmm. But my weight always has fluctuated yeah. and everything like that. But then after I had my daughter, my last daughter, um, who's four now, mm -hmm. so I kind of been on this journey yeah. for the past four years mm -hmm. of like truly making it something that's for me yeah. and that is healthy and that is a lifestyle change. That's it. That's and, it. And, and, it's and you mentioned accountability mm -hmm. to yeah. teach it was my accountability. Okay. If I'm mm -hmm. responsible. Yeah. Oh, that's good. If I'm yeah. doing something I love, then I'm responsible to do it throughout the week. I'm Basically. responsible to do it. I have to teach it. And that was a sort Isn't that a of, good plan, though? Yeah, it, it, it worked for me. I mean, you know, y'all are such go-getters, and I feel no, all that energy. Right? And I was like, I just got to start simple. And that was that's simple to it. me, and that was a platform that I could achieve. And yeah. So I did, I've been doing that for the past two years, and going on three. Mm -hmm. And then I just enjoy, I enjoy working out. I enjoy mm -hmm. the way my body feels. I Me enjoy too. feeling strong, capable, that That's my body it. can do it. Did you know 
notice your posture change and stuff too? Posture, arms are tone, yeah. core is mm -hmm. tight. You know, it's core nothing tight, for me yeah. to drop down and get back up. Right. You know? Oh, I saw you. <laughs> she, she be a clad look, because you know he asks us to squat. Yeah, but I just He'll even, cuss us out if we don't. He will. Don't, don't mess. He said, don't fuck up my song. Don't I love when they say that. And he said, stop all the fuck shit. Don't bring oh, the fuck man. shit to that. Oh. He cussed us out. I was like, oh, I know. Up. But today <laughs> was, today was new. <laughs> he said, <laughs> Dooley is who he is. The he owner, is the yes. owner of Effect Fitness. From Louisiana? And, uh, I, he from Louisiana. From Louisiana. My husband's from Louisiana. <laughs> but, like he said, let the great shit go. It's, no, let the good shit go. We own the great shit now. I love let that go. Yeah. Good, good, sometimes good ain't good enough, but we got to achieve, achieve Girl, greatness. Hold on, let's stick right there. <laughs> Going into 2020. Let the good shit go. Be great. Let the good shit go in 2019. 2020, it's a new decade. We need to be on some great shit. Be great. 2020 smells like be great. nice snatch bodies, LLCs mm, form, mm, mm. good credit, good relationships, good healthy health, eating, healthy eating, healthy mindset, mm. you know, mental wellness, networking, community. Like, 2020 feeling good to me. I'm feeling it. You, you right. our fears. That's it. Like, fuck your fears going into 2020. Like, fuck mm. all that shit. Like, I'm 38. Be I'm great. almost 40 years old. Just figure it so out. Good. Thank you, girl. And, and when I'm just figuring out, it's like it's just consistency. Yeah. And going to a pick, it makes it easy to go every day. It does. I every look forward day. to it. Every day. I know I so I make a unlimited membership account. Let's just be I know. Clear. And it's worth every penny though. <laughs> so I, I try care. to go five to six times a week. I'm like, I'm gonna get it. I'm a fiver. Yeah. Now, now last week I slacked the Don't baby. Worry. Don't and I came Don't back in that. there. This about where you coming back. I came in there. Hard yes. war, so heavy. Yeah, ways. for me, I, I tell people, you know what? If you don't have that community aspect around your major transition, you're not gonna succeed. Yeah, I mean, I'm sitting here with friends right now, and one, you know, very soon I'll be able to tell you more about the people that I just met through a transformational self development program. But this is actually big for me, Victoria. Mm. I wasn't big on bringing people into my personal space. Mm. I was blocking myself, mm -hmm. you know, a lot. And I'm glad that just going to a place like Effect Fitness yeah. and being in a comfortable environment where I can be authentic, mm -hmm. well, you find that it's a lot of like-minded people around there, too. Yeah, it is. Don't you think that we're like so socially awkward sometimes that we need to just be a little bit more outgoing with people? Agreed. Yeah. You know? I mean, and unfortunately, it's our responsibility as people to foster the environment for it to be welcoming, you know? Yeah. And then... You have to be comfortable. Then you have you have these extroverted people like Art and myself, right. but she <laughs> brought that energy. out of me because so I went to Effect independently, okay. um, and I knew people who were there, but I wasn't super close to them. Mm -hmm. So gathering relationships is important. Oh, it is. And it's it's, the it's it makes your experience at any gym that you attend. A community versus yes, just you, you just going in and walking out. I'm you want to build some sort. And I know that I mean, Effect does that. You know, you there's so many me. people. Mm -hmm. So you got to find the comfort to reach out and connect with other people. So we are ah, trying to get to the kitchen. Right. <laughs> so that's kind of like my journey and how I got here. And I'm all for it. Um, so what's the goals for 2020, uh, body-wise, before you get out of here? It's wow. hard. such a hard question. question. And it's so I said, I know y'all got to be sisters. Sisters in spirit. <laughs> melanated sisters. Hair twin sisters. <laughs> uh, I love seeing my reflection. It's so beautiful. Mm. It's really good. So tell me about these 2020 goals. What are we doing? <sighs> 2020. You know, that is a question that pops up so much. And when y'all were talking about setting goals, and I was like, man, I need to, you know, December. Um, as you approach a new year coming right. and a decade pass, it really makes you sit into a state of reflection. Yeah. And um, yeah, goals get really easy. challenging because fitness and health and weight loss is so like... Right. Uh, you it's fall like off, that, you like, get back uh, on, yeah, yeah. the scale effing sucks, yeah, you know? Yeah. And so you don't really know where you want to go with that. So I, I just want to see a slimmer me. I want to, just a slimmer me. I want to yeah. see body fat loss. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I want to see that. You want to get to like bikini because they know I be staying in bikini. Bikini. So do you want to do two piece type of thing? Is that well, like a, a goal? Here's the thing. Okay. Let's You'll find me in a two piece next time I'm in anybody's swim so just because of the level of confidence that you yeah. should feel in you yourself. Should. Sure now it's gonna be high waist because high waist high. High waist is cute though to too. You know, I just high waist. Listen, this is high waist, girl. It's not my stomach. It does what you need. 
Yes, it but does. For sure, I would like to feel even more comfortable yeah. in that. So, bikini and just yeah, sitting up and knowing all your fat ain't flowing yeah. now. But the key not only is that physical activity important, but it's that eating. Girl, that's the thing. And that's what it sounds like that's you got thing. under control. No, 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 no. I just have a regimen of detox. Like, if I eat some bullshit, mm -hmm. I'm about to be in that toilet. Like, yeah. all no, but and you know making what sure doing. I do stuff to counter it. Yeah. And then I got to do effect, like, because I can sweat it out. But again, it's I have true. to detox no, it right no. out of my body. But they go hand in hand. Mm -hmm, they and do. as well as like your mental uh, availability to tackle and achieve the goal. So. Tell them how if there's any way to get in touch with you. This is a positive sister in Atlanta. Um, hell, what's your Instagram? What's okay, your Instagram? so my Instagram is kd sumner. Um, oh no, it's not even a dot. That's my that's my email. My okay. Instagram is kd sumner s u n n e r, and Facebook is just my name, Katoya. Sumner. You can always come to a pound class and work out oh, with me yeah. at Vibe Ride Grand Park. Mm -hmm. um, and then there'll be some pop ups coming up in 2020. So oh, that's going to be cool. Vibe Ride. That's Vibe spin ride. class. Mm -hmm. yeah. Spin class, ladies. It's this spin. is what we need to be on right now. Spin class, cycling. Cycling as an activity. We talked about yes, that earlier. I'm about cycling. to get me a bike. So, yes. cycling. Hey. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Cycling, I got friends coming, but I mean, I really just wanted to wrap it up and just tell you guys, like, that's what I took away from 2019, going into 2020, friends, networking, um, self-development, accountability, um, getting out of my own way, out of my own head, you know, so I appreciate you, like, this is really good, I mean, I know I want to get to my party now, honey. You know, and all that good stuff. But well, thanks this for letting is, me come on. This is really on. good. Yeah. Thank you so Check much, girl. You're so great. And thanks for coming over here last minute to celebrate my birthday. 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 Yeah, birthday. Yeah, you don't do live videos, videos, do you? Pizza. None of my friends in here do. She was just, she was. I'm going to get there. I'm going to get there. None of my friends in here did. Does anybody want to do a live with me before I go? <laughs> anybody Happy birthday, y'all. Y'all make sure y'all show us some love for her yeah. birthday. Uh, yeah. I can't wait for y'all to like get into my yeah, friends because yeah, yeah, when you yeah. share and stuff, getting over your traumas, your hurt, your everything, and my other friends walking in. Yo, no. 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 I got to get y'all into my melanated friends. Come, come, come real quick. I got my live video going on too. What's going on? Did y'all see that dance? Did y'all see the bro 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 so Jaylen. I own like Seamoss product. Right. No, okay, so Jalen, it's good to have you on my first day. Marcus, um, what's up, man? Hey, love me. How are you? Thank you. Thank you. Right. you. Tell, me, tell me, like, um, a tip that you want to give them yeah. something, oh, great. either great. through us meeting, through what you learned this year. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah cause this this brother, he's a young brother, but he's yeah, very awake, and he's somebody that like really is into yeah. being authentic. Yeah. Um, and that's something that I liked about him is that he's willing to be authentic and he's open. Um, so tell everybody just a little bit about yourself and maybe just a little bit of how we met. I'm not gonna go into full detail, but just like what you got out of this year and what's going on. Twenty nineteen has been amazing. Oh my goodness, man. <laughs> I've been doing what Bro just was talking about. He just he just opened my mind. So we were talking about Jeff. I got right here. Plant based so, Jeff. Plant based Jeff. He he. I've been doing what he's been speaking on. With me. I get an L. It's not an L. It's a lesson. And then flip it upside down. It's a staircase. And I've been literally. But y'all know what I'm talking about, yeah, that? Y'all yeah, yeah, yeah. went deep. Yeah. We went deep. I love having deep country clubs in my house. <laughs> I've been doing that, man, with my life. So, um, I met Art just before I even say anything about myself. This is a beautiful queen right here. This is a gorgeous queen. You can do a lot of inside out. You can do She's handling herself at a very high level. She's moving in her bliss. So I really that's appreciate the, that's her. What so um, mm -hmm. met her at an event that was really dope. Yeah. You know, yeah. we have yeah. similar, similar, yeah. you know, vibes. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 I just really yeah. Yeah. appreciate her energy. So yeah. that's why I'm here. Yes. You know, oh, you're Scorpio too. You know, and I'm a Scorpio. Woo! And I'm a Scorpio. Yes. So, yes. I'm a Scorpio. yes. I, they're, they're, they're some of my faves too yeah, for different yeah, things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, y'all. Now, I am going to be doing more talking about what and how I met him, our transformational experience we just had around self-development. Like, I think what he and I just completed, which was a self-development program of sorts, it shifted my whole perspective about everything. Like, y'all will probably hear me talk about stuff in a different way. The person, the brand is so different now. Um, and I feel a lot freer. And I'm going to be able to share it in detail with you guys. I'm going to bring on one other person Hold on, I want to really give quick. a little something. How about oh, please, because I got 15% price. and so my phone is about to die. So <laughs> okay, what's to okay. say? What about your non-melanated Oh, I know. Yeah, <laughs> y'all ain't going to believe it. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see, watch them reactions, watch them reactions. They about to tell you, like, I know this ain't the right broadcast. I know that <laughs> art Girl, I am so open, and I'll be able to yes. tell you guys about the paradigm yes. that I was living in. Wonderful. Um, and how I think about things now. Mm. Definitely. It's and I'm, I'm more authentic. It's, it's been, been a huge shit. And that's perfect for 2020. Just a new decade. It's a whole new decade. You know, and I'm, yeah. I'm ready to can't do things stuff differently. Stuff and I can't carry it. Exactly. My it's friend Mark back there said, we can't carry this shit into a new year no, at all. And, and I don't want to. No, I'm doing something like, different just by having y'all in here. I feel like we bring a new energy, we might as well bring it in right. And that's it. It's that's gonna bring light to everybody. Oh, oh wow. you feel me? And it's, 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 it's only right, you know. Um, yeah, and so, as regards to me, like I um, like I said, I'm I'm living in my bliss now. I, I've been in that dark place that you told me about. They say you, know, you got a you, real positive vibe, young brother. That's peace, brother. Oh, that's beautiful mm -hmm. peace, peace king. Yeah, he's a good guy. Um, we got the same name, so that's a that's a beautiful yeah, vibe in so. itself right there. Yeah, they fucking with you. Yeah, that's cool, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you funny. Oh my god. What's up with that? So so like I um I'm currently a free agent right now, so I came out of college, I went to a small university. And right then at that moment, I I, I would say like a Three weeks after I graduated, I hit that depressed state that you was in. Mm -hmm. And I hit it because is real. the ceiling was so high for me. And when I didn't hit it the first time, mm -hmm. I said, oh, no. You know, mm -hmm. I kind of crashed. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? kind of was just like, is this for me? I yeah, was kind of so like, all is this, yeah, all or nothing thing. Yeah. It's like a, my family looking at me like, oh, okay. boy, you, you said you was. I'm like, okay, I did say it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. it's, it's one of those things where it's like, you, you, you don't want to quit, but you also feeling that pain at the same time. Absolutely. And like, it was really a, another lesson. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Another lesson, quit. So with that, being said, I jumped on my feet again. Mm -hmm. I got out of that dark place, and I did that um, with working out. Oh, nice. You know what I mean? Um, because it was something that I was doing for the NFL, mm -hmm. but it was also something that um, I was doing for myself. Mm -hmm. I started working out. I started finding people like Plant Based Man oh, right yeah. there and getting yeah. in tune with my mind, body, and spirit. Began a company um, called What It Takes to Be Great. Um, and it's mm -hmm. a it's a it's a mentorship program slash personal training program um, where I personally train kids and I mentor them at the same time. Um, you know, and I got it up to many kids, man. We got many kids um, that's in schools all over the country now. And um, I began that because it was something that I felt like I can have an impact on. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. What's up, bro? Yo, I love him. Totally hey, you better put that. Up. You better put that on camera. Yeah, she, 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 art is funny, y'all. Y'all know she funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you said you worked out, I mean, I was like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> She should have had you up there when she was doing that chocolate and vanilla thing. Yeah, I would. Out. Look, he talking about this form we did. You know, we we were in class, being in class with him. Hey, look, man, she would have tripped out. Movie. She couldn't have picked it up. She would have tripped out. But yeah, so literally with that, I saw like, okay, where do I need to be? Like, mm -hmm. it started showing me like, what is alignment for Jalen? You know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. let me think about that for a second. Mm -hmm. And I never lost track of the NFL. But I saw where my purpose could be. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? I really started seeing some light. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? And that got me out of that dark hole. I love See? it. I like how he's honest about being in a dark hole. No, I like, don't play Like, I love being able to Change be around life. people that can just be 
honest with what's going on. It's so many of us dealing with depression. It's so many people that's dealing with depression. It's a real thing. It's a very real thing. And how old are you? Tell everybody how old you I are. just turned 23. 23. Wow. Like, if yeah. I knew what he did and this, the same course that he just finished, if I had that at 23, like, I know I would be so much further. Um, so I really her, just, I her, really, her. really want to just give you a shout out because for all the young black men, young lions is what I call mm -hmm. them, those young lions, we don't need to just count them all out, baby. They will wake your ass up. They'll tell you stuff that you ain't even learned until you 50, honey. These young ones got it. You know, because the resolve he has, that was, that's the thing that impressed me about him. You know, the fact that he was open with what he was going through and he wanted to get it right. Like, it's a, it's a sincerity with that. Um, and I can't say the word authenticity enough because we, we think we're being real, but we want to be real and give you that representative mm -hmm. and act yes. like we got it together. But that also gives you power because he owned his shit. He wasn't running from it. And I got so much respect for you. Mm -hmm. As a 23, 24-year-old brother, like, people 50 years old be still hiding behind their mask. And we learn about those masks, you know, in class. And or you now, like, screw these masks, or man. now, if you want to be real, hiding behind the camera. Ooh! Wait a minute, you're too real. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Because story. I've been it's doing true. this so long, mm -hmm. and I feel like this is one of my most real broadcasts, though. Because mm -hmm. even though you saw me, see, you actually just helped me. Even though you saw me, you didn't really see me. Mm -hmm. You saw the mask I gave you. Like, it's just been recent since I started not wearing wigs. It's like, nice. it's been, uh, it's levels. It's levels to it. So, he is right on. Like, yeah, I was doing videos, but I was still hiding. Live. <laughs> Somebody said, Oh, 23, that's mm -hmm. precious. Thanks for speaking your truth. Many Most people definitely. can't. Yes, but it can't. Most definitely. Yeah. And that, that pushed me into so I started doing motivational speaking because of this, because of my story. Mm -hmm. And like that helped me get out of that darkness too. Like just speaking, man. Speaking yes, to speak do a truth. lot. Speak Please truth. speak. I'm 23. I'm just a walking voice, but it. it's literally important that we all speak our truth. Yeah. Like say what's on your heart. Say what's gonna mm -hmm. resonate with you, and then mm -hmm. let it resonate to whoever it's gonna resonate mm -hmm. with. You start with you, and it'll resonate with everybody else. Not mm -hmm. me. Yes. But for my phone, that I got like a few more bars or whatever. I just want to bring you. Follow me, man. Quick. My name is Jalen. Yeah, how can they get in touch with you? Jalen Dot Hollerman. It's my first and last name. J A L E N. J A L E N. Like Jalen Rose. And dot. then Dot Hollerman. H O L L O M A N. Yeah, Dot. Yeah. Come on in here. Yeah, so, yeah. guys, I got another beautiful melanated man. I can slide out so, you this, can so this class that I just did, he was in my class, and then I had. Another guy in my class. Oh, actually, he needs to see. Yeah, he's yeah, not gonna yeah, be come on. Focus. Black but y'all, I'm gonna give you Jalen's <laughs> information too. So, um, this is my friend La V, who is from the A, from the A. So that's a whole another special thing. He's a cancer, and he has such a good sense of humor. He can laugh at himself. Uh, what's something that's authentic as fuck for you right now? Before my phone does, just like go authentic as fuck. You want to sing something? You want to do a poem? What do you? What do you want to do? Just be authentic as fuck right <laughs> now. Got a haircut. Well, uh, for the viewers and everything, I just want I want y'all to know you have to be honest. Like uh, Jalen said, the brothers Jalen said, and the sister Art, y'all have to be honest with yourselves. When you're honest with yourself, you're truly able to move forward because you know exactly where you are in your life. Mm -hmm. And when you know exactly where you are, you know where to build from. Mm -hmm. Because if we don't know where we are, we really don't know what we're missing. Mm -hmm. So it's a unknown, unknown. So it's an un unknown, unknown. Yeah. And, uh, we have to be, we have to really be honest with ourselves and you never know what the next person is dealing with. So That's right. when you're open and you're honest and you start to Live that life, you'll start to see that life will be open and honest with you, and other people will be open and honest. Mm -hmm. And so, and people can tell, people can tell when you're not being all the way honest. Yeah. When you hold yourself back, and you're like, um. Well, I yeah. want to be honest and actually just sing a little line for me, real <clears throat> quick. Whenever there's life, you have a chance. Whenever there's love, you uh -huh. have a chance. Whenever there's hope, you have a chance. Whenever there's God with you, you have a chance, chance. You got a chance. Yeah! <laughs> it's my birthday! <laughs> I got some yes. cool friends, y'all. So, 
I'm gonna be doing is like a little part two series, part three for my birthday because you know I'm sad we do the most, honey. I'm gonna be celebrating my birthday all month long. Yeah. So I'm like cash out me, cash out me. <laughs> Art Kathy, dollar sign Art Kathy. Okay, I love all the support you guys give me. And yes, I'm working on that vegan cookbook. And thank you for the pre-sales, mm. by the way. Like I love my community. Like mm. I would not be here if it wasn't for y'all. Um, I got a lot to tell you guys about. Thanks to Plant Based Jeff. Katoya, my and my other friends y'all can't see that's up in here with me tonight. Um, I'm going into 2020 more authentic, more supported, um, with less things blocking me in my way. And you don't have to do any of this shit alone. Like, you can really lean on people. Um, so, I'll leave you guys with that. Thank you so much for joining me. And I will have so much more information for you guys with this. Right here, Iris C. Moss. This is probably the best birthday gift ever. Oh, Thank you so much. Like, this ain't weed, but it is right. perk, baby. Ooh. All right. So, shout out to all of you that are keeping it conscious, <laughs> keeping it healthy, and keeping it connected. All right. Bye, you guys. Right. And thanks for the birthday greetings. I love it.